Welcome to the Armani Talks podcast. I'm your host, Armani Talks. In this podcast, I'm helping you level up your five soft skills, public speaking, storytelling, social dynamics, emotional intelligence, and creativity. Five soft skills for you to change your life forever, skyrocket your confidence along the way. In this episode, we're entering the world of creativity, and we're going to be discussing a few profound ideas for content creators. Two of them being 1,000 True Fans by Kevin Kelly and The Long Tail Theory by Chris Anderson. I'm going to start off with The Long Tail Theory first because I believe it perfectly transitions us to the 1,000 True Fans rule. The Long Tail Theory is basically when you're measuring data, there's going to be a lot of spikes in the beginning. And traditionally, this spike measures the hit mentality. You know how it's like. Our society loves hits. It loves those very fancy jingles that everyone can sing along to. And around the end of the long tail is the tail. These are the parts which are hyper niched towards certain people. This is the exact opposite of the hits. Where the hits are being sung and rapped by the general society, the tail end of the spectrum are the sectors for hyper-targeted interests. So if you're someone that likes Harry Potter book number three and you want to build a fan club regarding it, you're most likely going to be on the tail end rather than the hit spike. Now with that being said, most creators nowadays, a lot of them may think that, yo, if I want to create content, that means I have to be famous. And if I'm famous, that's the only way that I'm going to make a living. But if you look at the long tail theory, what you're starting to notice is that the tail end of the spectrum shows that you don't necessarily need to get famous. Instead, you could pursue hyper-targeted interests. And I'm sure from the billions and billions of people all around the world that there is going to be at least 1,000 people who also resonate with your interests. And this is how we're now going to transition to the 1000 true fans rule. This is when Kevin Kelly said that you honestly just need 1000 true fans who are willing to buy anything that you put out into the market. And they need to at least spend $100 with you for a certain year for you to make a six figure income. Yes, I'm not including taxes. I'm not including inventory costs, I'm just including pure revenue. This alone allows us to understand business from a completely different perspective. For so long, the predominant business model has been scale, scale, scale. While nowadays, there's a lot of businesses that are trying to do the exact opposite. I believe there's this one fashion company that goes out of its way to only sell 500 pairs of jeans every single year. And these are pretty high-end jeans, as you can say. So they're charging a decent amount. But when you break it down like, yo, I just need 500 customers and then I'm going to be good. This creates a beautiful business model because at this point, they're not going to have a lot of the hassles that an extremely scaled company is going to have. A scaled company got to deal with egos, got to deal with paying all these different people, a potential betrayal from different employees, all these different ego problems. That's what I like to call it, that a small company does not have to deal with. When you're extremely tight knit within your community, business becomes fun. Nowadays, with the long tail principle and the 1000 true fans rule, it becomes more and more easier for these different content creators who have such specific interests to finally make a living. Communication skills absolutely can pay the bills, but one of the main things we have to understand is that communication skills is not fun if you're always regurgitating what other people are saying. If you're always trying to keep up with the latest algorithm change, it's not going to be fun that way because you are not going for the truth. Instead, you're going for certain trends. So by imbibing 
the 1,000 true fans rule and the long tail principle, you eventually are going to feel much more bold to speak your truth, keep on perceiving the truth in a more nuanced light, and sharing it with the utmost confidence because a part of you knows that at least 1,000 people from all the billions of people on the internet should be able to resonate with you. So nowadays, think about it like that. Rather than trying to be the hit maker, see how you can appeal to a certain niche at the tail end of the spectrum. Because behind the tail is where true creativity lies. And behind true creativity is where great truths will always be perceived. If you want to join my long tail and be one of my 1000 true fans, be sure to check out my free daily newsletter with 4,000 plus subscribers currently checking out my ideas on public speaking, social skills, emotional resilience, along with other topics. Check out the link in the description box. And if you do not see a link for some strange reason, go on armanitalks.com slash newsletter and sign up today. Thank you for joining the Armani Talks podcast, and I'll catch you on the next episode.